Hello, I'm Landis, and this is Subnautica. In this guide, I'm going to be showing you one of the locations of a data box that contains the Cyclops Thermal Reactor. Now, as always, we're going to start from the zero point. If you don't have your own zero point or are unaware of how to get the coordinates up in game, then click the video in the card now and there'll be a link in the description to a video that will show you how to do that. We're going to want to head south to southwest, about two pips off from the southwest. You don't need your radiation gear for this, and you shouldn't pass too many hostiles on the way, although it is important to note that this wreck is in between two ghost leviathan patrol areas. You should be sufficiently far away that you should not be spotted. I would definitely advise using the rebreather. You will be passing through the sparse reef. Good indication you're on the right track is the fact that you do just skim it. The wreck we will be exploring is about 450 meters down. I would advise having at least a Mark 1 depth module for your Seamoth, just so you've got the air to refill up on. And we will be heading quite far into the Grand Reef. You'll know you're in the right zone when everything goes to a lovely bluish purpley colour and you get to see the giant boars. During this journey, I do like to keep as close to the bottom as possible. The only real enemies you should find at the wreck will be warpers, which again are more of a nuisance than an actual threat. Crossing the sea trail path is normally a good indication you're getting close. And there we are. Once you're here, you see just there, glowing in the darkness, the data box that contains our Cyclops thermal reactor. If this video helps you, then leave a like. If you enjoyed this video, then why not subscribe check out the rest of the channel and if there's anything you'd like to see then leave a comment and let me know i've been landis this has been subnautica thank you very much and see you soon